Hey guys, this is Jeremy Newman with THSC. This is the best update in the Pardo case that I've brought you guys so far that the Supreme Court just a few minutes ago issued a stay in the case ordering the trial court to send Drake home immediately. And the reason that the Supreme Court gave for their order was they said that CPS clearly failed to demonstrate that there was any type of continuing danger to Drake that justified keeping him out of the home. And so guys, what that doesn't do is end the CPS case because the CPS is still probably going to be fighting to, to try and demand services and home inspections and things like that to try and get as much out of this as possible because they're going to be trying to justify what they've done here in order to save face. And that's what they've done through the entire case so far. The other thing to understand is that this is a temporary order from the Supreme Court because the Supreme Court has not yet responded to the mandamus that the family filed, which is basically an appeal. And so the order that they that they gave here is only going to remain in effect until the court issues a, a response to the actual mandamus that the family filed. And at that point, whatever they say on the mandamus will control. It's almost certain, though, that the, whatever they say in the mandamus will be at least as strong as what they did here in this stay. And so, guys, we're really, really excited about that, that Drake is going home. He should be able to go home immediately. We're going to have to keep battling at the trial court level in order to make sure that CPS is completely pushed out of this family's life and that they're not allowed to continue this abuse any, any longer. And guys, if you remember, this, is, this comes after I think a week or so ago when the Supreme Court issued a stay in another parental rights case that's before the Supreme Court right now uh, that we also submitted a brief on. Uh, where a, a biological father was having his daughter taken from him by a, a non-parent who had almost no relationship with the child. And the Supreme Court stepped in and issued a stay in that case as well and uh, told the, the lower court that they had to end the custody that they had given to this non-parent. So we're waiting in both cases now. We're waiting for the court to give a final opinion. But the temporary opinion that they've given is extremely favorable in both cases. So I've never been more proud of our Supreme Court than right now. And guys, we need your help to keep pushing, to keep battling at the trial court level in order to end this case as quickly as possible, as completely as possible, and in order to get CPS out of the part of those lives completely and to hold them accountable for what they did. Thank you guys for all of your support, for all of your prayers, for all of the information that you've shared, all the calls that you've made, all the donations that you've made. We need your help to just keep pushing this uh, here at the end in order to get this completely resolved. And guys, I just want to give give thanks to God for intervening in this situation and give him all of the praise, all of the glory for that, that clearly I think I've see, been able to see his hand at work here, that he resolved this issue, or he's resolving this issue, that Drake is going home. And uh, we want to give him the glory for that. So thank you guys for all of your support, all of your prayers. We're going to keep you informed, but this is really great news. Thank you guys.